All right, what up, YouTube? Asian Persuasion here with my boy Slim. You know, my boy Gordo back here. Let's go. Beautiful. In our media center, you YCS know. Ohio here. We're at the top 32 duelists. What's your name and what'd you play? Uh, hi, my name is Zach Stone. Played Pierce Sky Striker. We got top 16. Oh, 16. It's all, all right. good. It's all good. <laughs> uh, I'm going to show you the deck list, guys. All right, let's get in there. On that um, sexy mat, Yeah, it's pretty nice. Three Ray. Anyone that plays less than this, I don't know what they're doing with the deck. This card's insane. Um, three Ash, the safest hand trap to play. Um, it just it has uh, utility against every matchup. Trick Star stops reincarnation, stops engaging the mirror match, stopping any like Goki and any Soul Day, any like Goki that's like uh, relevant to their search. Uh, two Ogre, I just wanted to play more hand traps and feel safe against combo decks. Has merit against the mirror match and you stopping a uh, multi roll. It's good against like Alter Guys, so against Protocol. Uh, I even hit a lost roll today, and that's what got me into top cut, so pretty good. And the round up the hand traps, two Valor. Uh, shout out to Brian Rails, this card is uh, the nuts. Yeah. The nuts. Yeah, it was really good. Uh, being able to play multiple in the same turn is actually what made me like it the most. That's it for the monsters, very small monster count. Not even, there's only the real monster. Spells, free engage, free widows, uh, two multi rolls. I just didn't want to play three. Felt comfortable with two, it was perfect number, never would go back. Same with two area zero, you don't want to see more. Even with two terraforming, you can just target and send it and get value anyway. Um, the one-offs, jammy waves and afterburners, you don't really need two. You can kind of just get these whenever you want. Uh, Heart Heels base, you need it against the mirror match. Uh, Horn of Drones, it's at one. Eagle Booster, this card is like, the saving grace sometimes against Goki, you'll just not die, have a turn guaranteed. And in the mirror match, lets you play around like Widow Anchors, lets you play around like Hand Traps, uh, a lot of other stuff. This card's really strong. Uh, Shark Cannon, this, this card is literally what lets you beat the mirror for no reason. Um, shout out to Elvis, I watched him play, do this one time. He uh, Shark Cannon to Kagari in the end phase and just kept adding back Shark Cannons. And I'm like, wait, that's, that's insane. That's insane. That's so free. No, Elvis. <laughs> I got, I got, uh, I got cherried twice for my uh, Kagaris and Hayates, and I still won that game against the mirror. So yeah, this card is insane. Uh, that's all the Sky Striker cards. Um, next three shared ride. Um, it's Maxi. Unfortunately, you can't use it to turn. Uh, you can't use it your first turn if you're going second. But yeah, this card's literally Maxi. Um, so strong against the mirror match. I would hold my ashes just so I can stop this card if I if I needed to like make sure I can resolve plays. Um, against Goki, you'll just draw into hand traps and be able to stop them as they keep adding cards to their hand with a combo. Uh, really good card. Uh, two terraformings. Uh, again, it doesn't really matter what the ratio is. You just want to have more spells. Uh, two desires. Thanks to Edeception for convincing me to actually play this card. It's the nuts. Uh, it, you, you can brick and not have desires, or you can brick and have desires and possibly unbrick. So I just want to play cards as little help me get me there. Uh, two MST, you, even though twins are really strong right now, I didn't want to play something that relied on me having cards in my hand. Uh, I guess I can go on a little later in the profile why, and I can also pop my area zero to summon Ray if I really need to. Uh, two call by the graves, insane. The best card this weekend for sure. It has the most utility against any matchup, stops any hand trap. Uh, in the mirror, stopping Kagari, stopping uh, Rays. In, it's, it's literally so pivotal that, like, I don't know why you wouldn't play this card in this deck. It's so strong. Being able to set it for a turn and even getting value, like sending it with a multi-roll and chaining to hit something, is still really strong. Of course, Rota, the fourth Ray. Last cards in the deck, I played 41, so three Mind Crush. Um, card's really good. In theory, against Trickstar, you just hit Candina and they add it back with Licorice. You hit Engage when they have it, add it back with Kagari. And it even lets you prevent, it, it can stop evenly matched if they just enter their battle phase. So it's really strong. Uh, shout out to my sponsor, Tim, for letting me have all this high rarity stuff. Without him, couldn't be here. Nice. Go to the extra deck. It's pretty standard for the most part. Um, three Kagaris, again, shout out to the sponsor helping me out here. Make me look cool when I'm not. Three Shizukus, three Hayates. Um, three is important for this. I guess the only one I can discuss is, the only reason why I, I can say this is you want three is just so you have every option against the mirror match. And this card's really good. It, uh, like, people don't know how this, like, 
they can use this card to kind of play around other cards and even still get what they want. If you play spells, you can dump a spell you want to set again with multi-roll without having to engage and playing around shared ride. There's a lot of things that this card lets you do, so it's really good. I'm glad I played three. Um, on to the everything else. Boral Sword. I never summoned him, but it's good to OTK. Uh, Nagirsu, I summoned him like once. Uh, it, it's just non-targeting removal. I just didn't feel safe not playing any in my deck. Uh, Unicorn, uh, Phoenix, Cerberus, and Mermaid. Um, these are just the best generic links. Uh, monster removal, spell trap removal, and ability to kind of set anything back. And this just answers Ibly and also lets you uh, point down if you need to get rid of a nightmare and like make other links. So yeah, I just wanted it as a utility purpose. And for the side deck, I uh, decided three Gammas and of course Driver. I just wanted more hand traps. This felt like the strongest one. Uh, you can still play it against uh, Midbreaker Field. Just doesn't destroy. It still negates though. But this is just the strongest one. It uh, gets rid of the problem and stops all the effects. If you hit the Summon Sorcerers with this, summon sorcerers with this you could just win the game. Um, three Mind Control. You just want this for the mirror match and anything that kind of plays like uh, like annoying monsters, you can just mind control stuff, send it with multi-roll, send it with, uh, or target it with area zero. Um, it's just really good. And we go second in the mirror match post side. So we side these three in and up until top cut, I was going for, people were going first in the mirror against me. So it was just really good having all of these. Um, three twins. Again, twins are really strong right now. I just didn't feel comfortable maining it in the undefined meta. But yeah, I was citing this thing quite often, unless it was against a Goki. So this card's really good. Um, two evenly matched, not not three. I uh, just felt better only having two. I used it a couple times, but other than that, it's just an answer to like you know big boards. I didn't really side in against Goki. I just rather side in more hand traps and more disruption and be able to play instead of just trying to answer their like full established board. And then the last card in the side. Ah, uh, I mean. There's a lot of people in this event, but there can be only one. <laughs> uh, this card is just the only floodgate that uh, Sky Striker can play. Uh, against Goki, this is insane. You just activate this, they only control one warrior. They can't make a soul, period. Yeah. Uh, against Altergeist, they can only control one monster. So if you have this, Shizuku, and five spells in Grave, they can't win. Yeah. Um, and against dinosaurs, they can only control one dinosaur. <laughs> they can't activate Gamma. Uh, this card is just insane. Uh, I wanted to play something that sticks rather than play something that's like a one turn effect like DDG, a different men mention ground. Uh, if you get Heytrunated, you just flip this up and it stays on the board. So yeah, this card just, it, I said it in a few times and when I saw it, it, it helped me out. It's really good, yeah. So shout out to brother. Of course, shout out to Team Brian's room. Brian Reyes letting us stay, um, me and the boys. Brought back Ryan Murakami, UDS champion. Um, <laughs> shout out to the boys back home, shout out to Bullpen, my local, uh, shout out to Tim again for, the spo uh, for sponsoring me and letting me uh, go out and play. Anybody that I missed, I I'm sorry, it's been a long weekend, but you know, I'm not forgetting you guys. <laughs> I definitely shouted you out. Okay, guys. Awesome, bro. Congratulations on top 16 and thank you for the deck workout. Of course.